Hey everyone, I'm Captain Forest Falcon. Welcome to Summon Knight Swordcraft Story 2. So, once again, this is going to be a blind let's play just like the first one. And my only experience, I guess, just comes from what I've learned doing the first one. So I'm curious to see how different it's a feeling it's going to be going into this one. I mean, from what I've seen, from, my, from the very little that I've seen or heard, it, I, I get the feeling that this one may be better than the previous one. But maybe that's subjective, we're gonna find out. So, we got the boy character, we got the girl character. So, let's go, let's go boy. And our name is Edgar. Cause I'm not gonna, ch yeah, I'm not gonna change the names. Yep, yeah, lock that in. Okay, right on. We're doing great, there's only a little further. Hey! Uh, if anyone finds out that I let someone in, I'm gonna get into a lot of trouble. But I made a pro—I made a promise to Ryuga. A man can't go back on his word. Hey, even if it wasn't for Ryuga, I'm a craft knight. The word of a craft knight is stronger than the hardest steel. I can't break my promise, no matter what happens. Hey, look out! Who? Oh boy, are we starting the gender game already? Guess that gender is that a boy or a girl? I'm gonna go with. Ugh. Ryuga. Gosh dang it! They do this every time! I swear, with this game in particular. I'm gonna go with, uh... 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 If I could see more of that sprite, I would have a better idea. Okay, based on that one, I'm gonna go girl. <laughs> based on the actual sprite down there, I, I will say girl. <laughs> Ryuga? We'll see. I'm probably dead wrong. Ah! Oh gosh! Whoa! Edgar! Ow. And we're dead. Well, well that was a fun time. Are you alright? No. No, I am not alright. <laughs> oh, no need to worry. I'm just fine. Craft Knight does more than just make weapons. He also trains his body for the rigors of combat. You need to learn how to walk before you can fight in battle. You're just repeating what Blair told you, aren't you? You're still just an apprentice. Am I right? Gosh, I, I'm still so unsure on this person's gender. It doesn't matter if I'm a novice or an expert. I'm still a craft knight. Huh, you're worried about getting shouted at by Blair for this, aren't you? I wasn't thinking about that. I was thinking about why I promised to take you to Gora's gate. It's your own fault. If you hadn't fought so pitifully at our duel, you wouldn't have to do this. Gosh dang it, maybe it is a guy. I don't know! <laughs> I'm not pitiful, I could've won if I pushed myself a bit more. Whatever, you lost, I won. You made a promise and now you need to make good. The ruin might be a restricted area, but you still need to guide me in. I know, I know. Well then, watch out, there's a cliff over there. Falling off would hurt more than running into me. Alright already, sorry for making you worry. What? As if I'd be worried about you, come on, let's go. Ugh, <sighs> wait up, Ryuga. <laughs> Oh gosh, okay, so... Let's leave. I can't leave, I promised Ray you gotta delete it. Okay, so it's a him. Gosh dang it, I couldn't I couldn't tell for the life of me. I was getting the impression after talking that it seemed like it was a guy. So it was worth it coming down here just to get confirmation on the gender. <laughs> Come on, you know that we can't get into Gore's Gate if you're not there. I'm trying to apologize. You were the first one to get here. Huh? The gate's up ahead. Are you sure you want to go into Gora's Gate, Ryuga? There are some evil summon creatures past the gate, you know. Yeah, I want to see the monsters that are so powerful they could ruin the world. It's not fair that you're the only one who can go in and see them. I want to check them out. What can I say? I get it. You're scared of breaking Gora's seal, huh? Uh... Honestly, yeah, sure. Sure, I, I'm a coward. Let's just go with the... Huh? You're really afraid? Are you just trying to scare me so that I won't ask you to open it? Or are you just worried about Master Blair shouting at you? Stop that! This has nothing to do with Master finding out. I'm a bloody coward and you should have learned that by now. <laughs> to hell with you! You're not so tough in front of your sister, either. Shut up! That's not true at all! Well, that might be a little true. You should still shut up about it. Ha! <laughs> I told you so. 
She may not be my real sister, but she means a lot to me. I understand. Dad. Oh, once again, we're, we're flashing back to our to our father, who's probably dead, aren't we? Is that a thing? <laughs> hey, stop looking at what your real father left you. Blair's your dad now. You should be happy. I know he's a little weird, but still... Hey, it's not like I'm unhappy about it. He might be a little strange, but he's still a decent guy. Orin and Tatiana are good people, too. I don't have a problem thinking of them as my brother and sister. Uh, the reason I hang on to the stone all the time is because Blair told me to keep it with me. Okay, okay, I get it. Oh, by the way, the other day he said that he doesn't want you to call him Master. Uh, he said to call him your big brother. What? Why would I... Why would he say that? Uh, I don't understand Master at all. <laughs> you have a pretty nice family. I'm a little jealous. <laughs> but I envy you too, Ryuga. For what? Uh, dude, Lynn's a total babe. Huh, she might be beautiful, but when she said hope she... Wait a minute. Where's Where is this conversation going? What? She... What? Shut up, I think I heard something. Ah. Uh. Hey, I heard it too. It's a voice. It came from over this way. Over there? Oh, my house used to be in that direction. Okay, cool. Just, just drop me out. Okay, fine. The game's not going to let me run off the path. I'm just figuring out. So, this will presumably be a place we come back to, I'm guessing. Look, Edgar. Somebody on the ground? Wait a minute. It's not human. It's a summon creature. What is it? Uh, it's, uh... Who's over there? Uh, is this... Is this choosing our summon beast? Is this choosing our summon beast instead of asking vague questions we just get outright choose it? Okay, so a mechanoid soldier, an oni child, a devil girl, or a half beast. Huh. Okay, so... Either way, one of these is going to be a thing. So, I'm... Just because last time uh, I had Xantech as my partner, I think I should choose something different than that. I... Oni child, curious, devilies. Oh, I wonder. Was this a... Were those actually flashes of the ones at the start? Okay, tell you what. Uh, give me one second. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I just went and did a random number generator. And the number that came up was three. A devil girl. So that's what we're going with. Oh boy. Oh boy. They weren't kidding. Just straight up a devil girl. Ugh. Uh, is it a girl? I really can't tell from here. It's a summon creature from the spirit realm of Sapareth. It's a devil. Why is it here? So devils are from Sapareth? Oh gosh, I can't remember anything from the realms. I should. Uh, was Sapareth where... I'll figure it out a bit later, but... Why is it here? Was it ambushed by some nasty monster? What about a nasty monster? I didn't say there was one. But whatever hurt this summon creature, this badly must still be around here somewhere. Keep your guard up, Edgar. Okay, cool. What's that? Uh... <laughs> are, are you telling me that's the nasty, nasty monster? It looks like a combination between, like, a dog and a penguin or something like that. <laughs> okay, not a dog and a penguin, it's more of like a... What is that? Is that like a seal and a hair? Sheesh. So, uh, like, its sprite looked to be like a dog and a penguin, and then its sprite here looks like a seal and a hair. <laughs> like, it's got, like, floppy ears. Oh, it actually says Rampage Rabbit. I'm an idiot. Hiss! <laughs> but still, that looks like a seal more to me. <laughs> I don't care. I'm sticking with my idea of it being a seal. <laughs> you dang rampaging seal rabbit. Wah! Oh. Okay, so what do we got for weapons? Oh, we got some... So what do we got for weapons? We just got the one weapon, right? Okay, he's gonna bite me. So pretty much this feels pretty much the same. 
Okay, cool. So can I just use this as much as I want? Let's see... I probably can't do any th fancy skills since this is like just a crafting weapon and it isn't a real weapon as it was with Summon Knight 1. So basically just straight up just hammer it. <laughs> anyway, it it's a bit weird to hear like the voice clips in there. This one. <laughs> okay, cool. Cool, just give me a free level up. Okay, so... One thing that I've figured, uh, I'm probably going to want to stack up some attack, just based on experience from before. Just really want go to go ham on attack, I think, at first. Are you alright? Uh, yeah, I was just caught off guard. Like I said, a craft knight is trained in the ways of battle. Okay, but why are you carrying that hammer anyway? Uh, the hammer is the soul of the craft knight. I eat, sleep, and even take it with me to the bathroom. Yeah, after all, as we know before, a hammer can forge a man. That's the truth. <laughs> Wait, you're serious? Of course I am. What's this summon creature doing here in the first place? What kind of talk is that? Huh? That stupid animal just started attacking me for no reason. I ran all the way here. I'm the victim here. I think you could at least show me a little sympathy. Uh, I'm sorry. Wait, what? Uh, I think she might have stumbled into its territory and it got angry and chased her all the way here. Hey, I'm not some bumpkin tripping over her own feet. Show me some respect. Same here. You should be grateful that Edgar here stepped in to save you. What are you talking about? It's only natural to step in and save a girl in his stress. What? Uh, come on, you two. Don't stop me, Edgar. This girl needs to learn the errors of her ways. Uh, you don't... You two don't need to fight each other out here. Just chill out, please. Huh, where'd this come from? I'm used to dealing with people like her. Huh, then you must know how well, how special I am. Uh, special's one word for it. Uh, yeah, Edgar, yeah, I, I know where you're going. <laughs> yeah, and I think she's getting the impression too. With the implications there. I'm not doing so well. Are you alright? Did that rabbit hurt you? No, no, but my feelings are hurt. Oh, come on! Hey, hey. Wait, how'd she even get into the village? There's a ward around here to keep summon creatures away. Blech. A ward? I didn't see it. Uh, I guess one of the keystones must have collapsed. We'll have to tell the chief about that. Hey, wait, where's your master? Uh, I'm not serving anyone at the moment. My master died in a war a while ago. I see, so you're a stray summon. Um, or I probably just gave her, like, Ryuga's voice back there. That was my mistake. <laughs> I'm sorry, but this village doesn't allow any stray summons in. I see. I'm weak, and you're trying to kick me out of here, huh? Out into the forest where all kinds of dangers await a helpless girl? Oh, woe is me. Uh, no, I didn't mean that. There's a saying that if you save someone's life, that person is your responsibility until you die. What are you going on about? If you're going to give me the boot, you at least owe it to me to escort me to a safe place, right? Hey, show some respect. You wouldn't be here arguing if it wasn't for us. Whatever you say, but I like, like I said, you have an obligation to keep me safe now. Now I demand that you take me to a place that is nice and comfortable and full of mana. Oh, what the? What's she doing? Uh, is she faking it, or is she actually got a, suffering from mana depletion? Oh. Huh? Are Are you okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, wait. She's an angel, or is she both? What? What? I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Please forgive me. Or is she both? Does she just switch be between both? What? the heck is this? I'm sorry I said such terrible things when you'd helped me so much already. Is this... Is this like some weird act she's doing? Um, okay, stop apologizing. What the heck just happened to you? No, I must apologize. I don't have much control over her, but I couldn't let her get away with acting like that to you. I'm really sorry about that. Oh gosh. Is, is, did we just pick up a split personality individual? Is she two people in one? 
I'm sorry. <laughs> and she's back. <laughs> I'm not apologizing. Uh, she's turned back. What the heck happened to you? Uh, she's an angel living inside me. I hate her. An angel? I got mixed up with her somehow. She's screwed up my life ever since. You got mixed up with her. What do you mean? I'm tired and she managed to take over my body and apologize to you. I certainly wouldn't have done it. Look, I'll have no problem getting out of here, but will you at least give me a chance to rest? Uh, I think she's being honest this time. She does look really tired. Yeah, you can get some rest at my place. Ooh! Okay, I accept. I'll take a break at your house. All right! Uh, I don't know what you're thinking. Well, I'll go tell the chief about the fallen stones. Thanks, Ryuga. Hey, wait up! What now? Uh, we haven't been introduced yet. I'm Edgar, that guy's Ryuga. Don't call me that guy. Oh, sorry. And, and what's your name? Okay. How do we? How are we gonna pronounce that? We're sticking with default names, just like last time. Dina or Dinah? How are we gonna pronounce that? Mm, I'm gonna go Dinah. Okay, Dinah. That's your name. Dinah like a dinosaur. <laughs> nice meeting you, Dinah. I guess it doesn't hurt to know your name. Well then, let's go back to my place. Cool! So... Obviously, I would assume we'd get some... Bit curious what element she's gonna be. Are you feeling better? Uh, I could rest for a little while longer. Oh? Tatiana? Did you get me something with lots of mana like I asked? Hey, I don't like your attitude! And what's mana, anyway? <laughs> what? You don't know what mana is? Or you've heard of it, haven't you? Uh, of course. Uh, mana is... Um... You don't need to lecture me now. Orin, you're treating her far too nicely. It's just because she's a girl, isn't it? Why are you getting angry at me like that? Let her be a little spoiled. Uh, sh she's already... She clearly is already used to that. I don't think that's helping her. Dinah's sick, you know. Oh, thank you, Orin. Don't shout, Tatiana. It's embarrassing me. Uh, don't talk to her like that. Oh, I guess you were being a little loud in front of our guest, Tatiana. What? Why me? See, you're shouting again. Hey, calm down, you two. <sighs> I can see you have lots of problems here, huh? I didn't expect to get sympathy from you. Oh, boy. Oh, do we have a guest? <laughs> oh, Master! Welcome to Craft Knight Blair's place! Hey, a summon creature! We don't get too many of that around here. Who's her master? Uh... I don't have a master right now. That means... You're a stray summon, is that right? Yes. Oh, what are we gonna do now? Yeah, stray summons aren't allowed inside this village. What are you saying? I'm only here because Edgar invited me. Is that right, Edgar? Well... If you insist on expelling me from the village, then you'll have to guide me to a safe place filled with mana like you promised, remember? Wait a second, I never promised you that. Now you deny it. If you want to help me, you have to see it through to the end. That's how it goes. Start packing. There's no mana around here, so it'll be a long trip. Bring lots of food. Uh, I don't know of anywhere like that. Then go find it. Don't try to drag me along until you know where you're going. Why, you mean-spirited little psycho. There's nothing wrong with me. You should be glad to have the opportunity to help me like this. I... Oh, is she transforming? Going back to Angel? She gonna flip out again? Yeah, Edgar. I am sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Back to Angel. Whoa, she transformed. Oh no, I'm very sorry. Hey, Edgar, what's going on? Yeah, Dinah said that there's an angel inside her. I guess it comes out whenever she gets too nasty. That's a rare summon creature. 
I'm very sorry that we said such terrible things to you after you let us into your home. Oh, dear. I don't think it's your fault. Yes, it is. I can't control her emotions as she says such horrible things. Please excuse us. We'll be out of here right away. Oh, hey, don't, don't worry. You don't have to run away like this. Oh, no, I can't introduce and intrude any further. Please just let us leave you alone and not bother you anymore. What now? I'm sorry. Ugh. Ah! And she's back. Hey, are you all right? <sighs> she made me apologize again twice in one day. I can't believe it. Is it that hard for you to apologize? <laughs> it looks like you two are having fun together. What, are you paying attention? I was having fun just watching them argue. Listen, uh, Dinah, we're a Craft Knight family. Craft Knights? You mean those who melt metal and then hammer them to make things, right? Craft Knight basically makes weapons. We have a workshop in the basement. Would you like to check it out? Uh, hey! And... Okay. And they're off. Please, please tell me we did we get a break. Come with us, Edgar. Uh, wait a minute. Okay. Okay, that was that was just a lot, whole lot of talking. Uh, I can't do anything uh, to ch chat with anyone or anything right now. Okay, so basically, uh, we met Dinah. Yeah, I'm going with that, unless you guys want to tell me it should be pronounced differently. Basically, we just met who I'm assuming is going to be our guardian beast through this journey, if it's anything like Summon Night 1. <laughs> and oh boy, th thank you so much, uh, Thank you, random number generator, for landing this on me. We'll find out how this goes in the future. So, thank you all so much for watching. May you soar like the amazing falcons you are, and have a wonderful day. Peace out.